It has stood over the city of Columbus for more than 100 years, but now a lightning strike last Thursday has put the future of the historic Chapel Street water tower in question. Concerns over the structural integrity are such that two neighboring homes have been evacuated. As our colleague Dave Delosier tells us, the history of the stone water tower is clear. Its future is not. It was built in 1896. And for better than 100 years, the stone water tower has been symbolic of a community. And one of the, you know, points in town that just make you think of Columbus. Last Thursday night, around 5.30 history meant an uncertain future. It was a pretty heavy thunderstorm, lots of lightning. When lightning struck the old historic water tower, it sent brick and mortar flying in all directions, including showering it down onto the roof of a neighboring home. The bricks were spread a little bit further out, um, some damage to an adjacent home. So we knew we were in for something a little more serious. And it became even more serious when a structural engineer raised questions about the integrity of the tower. And at this point, the adjacent property owners have been evacuated and they're staying elsewhere for the time being. Um, the, the, en the structural engineer is uh, concerned about the stability. Signs now warn neighbors where they should go and where they should Pokemon stop. Where the future of this historic water tower goes will be decided once the structural engineering reports and insurance findings are submitted. A decision that will balance the safety of a community with the desire to preserve a piece of history. Being the historical value that that structure brings, there is a, a feeling that, you know, it, we could try to do what we can to save it. In Columbus, this is Dave Delosier, WISC News 3. The city has been communicating with the residents of the two homes located next to Stonewater Tower. It may take several weeks, however, the, to resolve the safety concerns surrounding the tower.